I'm removing my mask guys, so move away. Nothing can dampen my spirits today. Hi, my name is Larry and today we're gonna talk about Bird Dog's latest products, the Flex 4K family. And to help me talk about these products, I want to introduce to you our virtual specialist. Hi Larry. Hi, Hi Larry. Larry. Greetings, Greetings everybody. everybody. I, I hope, hope you are, are all okay. okay. You know you don't have to speak like that, right? <laughs> I know man, I'm just playing. My name is Lar E and I'm one of MediaCast's virtual specialists. And today I'm excited to talk to you about the latest products from BirdDog, released just now, I might add. Let me introduce to you the BirdDog Flex 4K family, the world's smallest NDI converter. In this video, we will show you two products, the Flex 4K In and the Flex Backpack. Following the success of their earlier encoders and decoders, the Birdo Studio, the Birdo Mini, the 4K encoders, decoders, now they've created a product that primarily focuses on people who are just looking for a device that would just either encode or decode. You know, they don't need both functions at the same time, right? Absolutely, Larry. And we have spoken to a number of our customers in the region who are just looking for that, as it would save them a lot of money in turn. Hold on to your seats because we will show you how it works. Yes, now this is your Bird Dog Flex Air. First up, it's PoE powered. So I just connected it to our PoE switch and now it powers the device. On your first use of the product, you have to log in to its web interface. Let me show you the web interface. Let me take it from here, Larry. Now in order to access the web interface of the Bird Dog Flex, you would need to connect to the device via its IP address. There's an easy way to do this, and that's by using the serial number located on your bird dog device. Using the last five digits of the serial number, type in bird dog dash the last five digits of the serial number dot local. And voila! Behold the web interface of the Flex 4K in. That's really easy. And I think I know what the password is. I know it too. The default password of the web interface is BirdDog in all small caps. And now you're in. Larry has mentioned some unique features of the product a while ago, like it's the world's smallest NDI encoder. It's really pretty portable. When you get the Flex Backpack Series, you basically get an NPF style mount that can basically power your monitor. So you power this via POE, but it's actually more than that. The creators and the product developers from BirdDog have spent a lot of time putting the most of the NDI technology in this small box. Really exciting stuff, guys. Really, and you can see all of that when you look at the user interface. And from here, you will see that you know, there's no input connected right now. The system is active. And from the network, you can set your IP. And here's how you set it. If you have a DHCP server, you can also use DHCP for the configuration method. We don't, so I'm using a network switch right here so i put just static right there we all know that the flex in is an ndi encoder it's actually a 4k encoder which means that i can have a 4k source convert it to ndi and then let it run through our network right so when you look at our av setup you will see that under video mode it allows me to choose between 4k and hd resolutions we can also manually indicate the video input format which we will leave to auto for now. Now, there are pretty unique things about BirdDog when it comes to them creating their NDI encoders. And these are some of it. First, the onboard tally. BirdDog has a very special tally system right here. Yes, I know. That Halo tally light is pretty awesome. Yes, the Halo tally light. And it's really, really cool. Now, let's dig more into the system. The latest release of NDI is capable of failsafe and the engineers from BirdDog has integrated that into their converters. So in the interface, you can actually see that you can assign your failover source. So if anything happens to this source, the NDI network will immediately switch to that failover source. So BirdDog integrated that into the system. So not all NDI encoders can do that because that feature is specific to manufacturers. So if they want to integrate that, then they can integrate that. And happily, BirdDog did that. Additionally, you also have a PTZ control available in the system, which means that if you've connected a 
PPZ camera that is not NDI and you want this device to convert that to NDI at the same time run your presets of the camera you can absolutely do that as well and for NDI lovers out there you know that NDI4 is now capable of multi TCP transmit method so in your interface you have that option of running in multi TCP as well hey Larry yes I'm hyped up let's show the flex in action of course talking about our setup we have our flex in connected to the same network as my laptop now all i have to do is connect my camera source that has an hdmi output and no ndi functionality whatsoever and connect that to our flex in now let's look at our web interface so as you can see here at our ndi connection info it says that it has no input all i have to do now is first find the cable and then connect it to the flex and it instantly updates the source so right now i'm running a 1080p 50 422 signal coming from my camera which means that right now this camera is now available as a source that can be used by any ndi capable devices in our network hey larry yes now that we've connected the camera to the flex in Let's access the video signal through NDI. The easiest way to test it is to open your NDI tools. If you're running on Windows, it's gonna be the NDI Studio Monitor. And if you're running on Mac, like what we have right now, all you have to do is open your NDI Video Monitor. Now, NDI Video Monitor is a tool that lets you see or monitor all the NDI sources that are available in your network. For example, in our setup right here, we have the BirdDog P200 our PTZ camera connected to the same network with our NDI encoder right here which is the flex in now if I click the HDMI and that's basically our producer right there and he's the one running the show hello and that's how easy it is the flex is truly an awesome product as it packs a lot of punch in a small form factor imagine transmitting your video signal power and more all in a single cable. As you can see, there's a lot of potential when you start to consider NDI in your production workflow. And we really didn't talk a lot about it. There's a lot of things in that. So you have your Dante support. Not to mention built-in intercoms using bird dog comms. Yes, he's correct. And you have your tally, you have your PoE power, you have your fail-safe function, and a lot more. To know more about these products, you know how to reach us. Again, my name is Larry. And my name is Larry. Thank, Thank you for, for watching. watching.